Yo, what's up, my mullet sharp here, bringing you guys another video, and this video is gonna be on the Xbox One. This is gonna be, I don't know if I did, I don't know if I've done an Xbox One video on my channel. I know I did some gameplay for it for the Teen Caliber channel, but I'm gonna be playing some clan battles. So let me make my classes here. I'm just gonna make the the typical just kill whore run around class. Uh, I'll throw a frag on, and then we'll have the vector. Let me take off. I don't know why I'm quick quick drawing, but. Anyway, the reason why I'm playing Xbox One is because we qualified for COD Champs last weekend. And not really qualified, we qualified for the regionals to play. So we got to go to the regionals in Florida, and then the top eight teams from that qualify for COD Champs. So, yeah, we, we got a lot of stuff to do, but uh, regionals in Florida is going to be on Xbox One, so... As soon as my team, as soon as uh, Gunjar and Theory get their check from Columbus, they're they're gonna be purchasing Xbox Ones, and will be uh, practicing on Xbox One, pretty much into all the way until Champs. And then I don't I don't think MLG is gonna be making the the transfer. I think Champs will probably be like the only Xbox One event. I don't know about Gfinity, but I'm fairly sure that UMGs and and MLGs are gonna stick to 360. So uh, we're just gonna play this and then be done with it. And then go back. I don't know why everyone always wants to play SD. That's what we're doing. So let's go assault rifle. Good. Alright, that class works. But anyway. Um, so yeah, Regionals is going to be in Florida. And it's going to be on the Xbox One. So we're all going to be practicing on this. And, uh, basically, la last weekend, if you guys didn't know, we played in the, or not last weekend, I, I guess it was last weekend, but last Saturday, we played in the, the online qualifier, the, the preliminaries for the United States, uh, the very first one, and my team, we, we beat out Collapse, which consisted of Pac-Man, Fears, Looney, and Wheats to, to qualify. Uh, the other teams that qualified consist of Optic, Envy, Us, Complexity, I'm forgetting. Obviously, I'm only at. Who else qualified? I don't know. Search and destroy. Anyway, pretty much, pretty much all the top eight are justice. Justice qualified. Nezlo's team, the justice, they qualified, uh, and then I'm forgetting one. And if you watch this video and you're part of the team, I apologize, but I just forget things. And, I'm out, and this is a live commentary. A lot of you guys are like, oh, why don't you guys, why don't you do more just regular commentaries anymore? And I'm just like, you know, I just, I did a lot of those. This guy wants to follow me around because he, oh, I'm on Sharp's team. I'm going to be an asshole and shoot. All right, never mind. He's running away. All right. I apologize, Apex. I just got a lot of people who follow me around and just had to shoot at me and fuck up my game. So it's stun on me. <clears throat> but anyway. Yeah, so if you watch this video and you're part of that team, I apologize. I just have a, a shit. But th that was probably the most stressful thing about the whole thing uh, is playing online. Just because you had to think about people host booting. You had to think about the connection being bad, playing against Warriors, uh, and just all that thing. And, and Team Caliber is not really one of the best online teams out there. Excellent job, team. We, Get ready for the next round. we usually do better... Not usually. Every single time we do better on land uh, compared to how we play online. Now we have been getting a lot better at, at, at online. You know, we've won a couple of our league matches. Uh, if you guys do not know what the MLG Winter Invitational League is, uh, it's where they have the top eight teams playing in that. And we actually will complexly drop out. But we are tied with fourth on that, and we I think we played a night. Might be our might be our last two matches. I'm not sure. But, but we're, we're tied with fourth on that, and the top four teams make it in, so we stream that on MLG.TV backslash caliber. And I know a lot of you guys don't like the MLG stream, but uh, they're working on getting God, it better. Damn it. What the hell is that noise? Rank up? Oh, goddamn orchestra for me. I just need a little thing telling me I ranked up. Uh, so, yeah, winter invitation, you guys should check that out. I'm just going to use a sub and run around. I really like the vector on the Xbox One. It, the game definitely feels different. If you guys have never played it, 
the game is different, the guns sound different, the guns shoot different, and it just looks, it just obviously it looks different because it's an, it's a next-gen console, so the, the, the graphics are better, the colors are sharper. Um, thermal's kind of a bitch on this game. It's not really as good, it's kind of hard to see through thermal. Sorry, I gotta meet these players. Doing a live comedy over here, breathing and shit. Uh, and I don't even have a. I, actually, I do have like the the default mic that came with the Xbox One, but I, I don't use it. One time I was playing Battlefield, and I had my Kinect plugged up, and I was like sitting here just like, "Fuck!" Oh, he's right there in front of you. Oh, I like that shit. But yeah, I had I had my my Kinect plugged up, and I was like sitting here like, "Ah, oh, damn it!" Not like like talking to people like, "Yo, who the fuck you talking to?" And I was like, "Oh shit!" And I was like, I had my Kinect plugged up. I don't know. I was playing eights last night with uh, some of the pros. But yeah, I was playing eights with some of the pros last night, and it, it just it, it just has a different feel to it. Like the controller, obviously, is different, and the thumbsticks are like they're really loose, so it makes your sensitivity feel a lot higher than it is. So three sensitivity on the Xbox One feels faster than three sensitivity on the Xbox Series. Now I'm not lying. You guys are gonna ask. Oh, what, what about scuff? Scuff? Where, where's the scuff? Where's the Xbox One scuff? Sides. I'm guessing. I don't know anything. I don't. I don't know if if they will have. An, I mean, I'm assuming they will have an Xbox One scuff. Uh, whether it'll be ready in time for champs, who knows? Uh, I'm assuming it will be, just because that's going to be like one of the biggest FPS events of the year. So I don't know why they wouldn't want their product there and you know people using it. But I don't know. We'll, we'll see. I'm just assuming that it will be ready by the time, by time Champs is around. It is weird not playing with the scuff. You know, I, I didn't use a scuff all the way. Oh my god, that shot's awful. All the way up until caught Champs for, for Black Ops 2. I didn't use a scuff at all, Excellent and job, get ready for the next round. like playing with it, you just you just get used to like scuff jumping. And I've actually picked up a knife reaction. Uh, you know, I, I I used to not be able to knife anyone ever, panning knife or anything like that. Even even with the scuff, I would never knife people. Just because Black Ops 2 knifing was really useful. Switching sides. Honestly, it was awful. And this game, it, it's, it's kind of a factor. You know, the knife is really good. Search and destroy. And so I picked up a knife reaction. Theory would be like, dude, you need to start knifing. Destroy like, the objective. <clears throat> there's one day, just sit there and think about it. Just start fucking knifing every time. He's like, eventually you'll just, it'll be second nature to you. He's like, you get a lot of clutch kills. Uh, and I actually clutched around against Looney. And, uh, yeah! Oh, this guy's a shoddy. I thought he killed me with a regular gun. Oh, shit. I actually clutched around in the in the qualifier against Looney's team, uh, Warhawk. It was a one-on-one -on -one S and D. He came through post, and I just like knifed his shit. But yeah, the knifing is a factor, so it, it is definitely weird playing without a scuff, just because you, you're not sitting there with the paddles always jumping. People, people are like, oh, people are gonna struggle without scuffs. I don't know how many people are really gonna struggle without scuff because only scuff helps your aim. Actually. I bet the Xbox One scuff. I hope I hope the sticks are, are like tighter. I hope they have they have some tighter sticks, and it makes. Switching sides. <clears throat> I, I'm hoping that they do that just because, you know, like, like I said, the, the search and destroy. The sensitivity feels a lot higher on this game. It's just something you gotta get used to. Like, like Parasite had said last night. It's just muscle memory. All gaming is is muscle memory. So yeah. Hopefully. I can get you guys some. <clears throat> I want. I, I posted a scrim, like MLG breakdown, and, and this is what I don't understand. Like some people on my channel are like, I don't. You know, we don't want to see the pub videos. And I guess. It's, it, I guess you know, posting videos is kind of like music. I just need to post. You know, what I want to post. You know, like what, if I stream, I need to listen to the music I want to listen to instead of trying to please everyone. Excellent I think that's one of my biggest problems. I try to please everyone. So if I see one comment of someone like. We want to see more competitive videos. I post a competitive video, it gets the least amount of views on my channel. And I'm just like, I'm just sitting there like, you know, why would I post competitive videos? I don't understand I'm a competitive That's player, but like, why, why post something that gets the least amount of views? You know, you, you obviously you want to post something Search that gets destroy. the best amount of views. I don't know. I, I guess I just need to find a good, I need to find a good thing. And I don't know if you guys are going to say in here, like, oh, we like your trolling videos, we like your competitive videos, just do what you want to do, and, and, and that's really what I'm going to do. I, I enjoy posting those those trolling videos, I think a lot of you guys... Look out here with your shot. I think a lot of you guys enjoy watching it.
And a lot of you guys enjoy commentaries like this, just sitting here me rambling and talking about whatever, doing live comps, playing. And a lot of you guys enjoy that, but uh, after a time, you know, shit gets old. Uh, like, if, if someone was like, dude, you should just post only 1v1s on your channel, and I'm like, you know, I, I do my 1v1s, and people like them, yes, but if I posted it for every single fucking video, people are like, Jesus Christ, stop with the fucking 1v1s already. And I've kind of slowed down with doing the 1v1s just because, I don't know. I need, I need, I need to get back. I, I tried to play Gunjar. I had one v ones against Gunjar, Excellent and job, I had team. those. And like, it was round. good, and I whooped his ass in it. But there was like an echo in the background. And I don't know if you guys are like put, oh, put music over and do that, but I don't know. I would rather have our voices and, and the shit talk. Switching like we were talking sides. shit to each other, and I think it'd, it'd be better like that. So I might, I might rematch him. Search Only post it if I win. <laughs> nah, I'll post a loss, but. Defend objective. What can we talk about? They did update the, uh... Oh, they didn't update the COD Esports rules. I mean, the COD Esports rules don't really lag when you play them. They, they used to, when people would change classes, it would lag. The only thing that bothers me about the COD Esports rules online is the stupid-ass timer. Because every time you play... What is this guy doing? Every time you play a league match, um... You have to do the COD Esports rules, or like when you play that qualifier, you have to do the COD Esports rules. And it's like a 70 second timer every time. You're just like sitting there, like, Jesus, I'm gonna go comb my mullet or some shit while we wait. Oh, and also, a lot of you guys say, oh, bring back 2v2s with Moho, 2v2s with Moho, do that, do that. I don't really know, I don't even really know what Moho's doing. Uh, ever since that whole thing happened with, uh, you know, the Strictly Business team joining him and then leaving him all within one day, he just kind of been. He's just kind of been out there, and like I don't really know what he's been doing. I know he, I know he played in the qualifier with Assassin, Wolf, Switching and sides. Demented, maybe or no Legend, Assassin, Wolf, and Legend. And destroy. But other than that, I don't know. I don't really know what he's doing. I know I see him posting like Daisy videos and shit. So I think he's just been kind of just chilling. Uh, so I haven't really hit him up about playing the two v twos just because I've been busy playing with my team, and I just, I just don't feel like. He really wants to play Call of Duty right now, so I just haven't really been bothering him about it. But it's always a possibility for those to come back. I know you guys enjoyed those two games. I enjoy, I enjoyed playing them. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Right now, my main focus is, is COD Champs and, and playing that. And after COD Champs, you know, it's just, it's just easy, easy points after that. Because you, you, you play COD Champs. And tournaments after that, obviously, you know, I play for the money, and, and it's fun to, it's, I play for both, you know, I play for the money, but I also play for the competitive, nice work, you know, I, I'm competitive, and I like going to events and, and, and playing and winning and all that stuff, uh, you know, because going to, going to, like, UMG, the prize if you win is good, but, like, last UMG, I made, like, a thousand bucks, and, like, UMG Atlanta, we came second and made, like, 300 bucks, so it's not, like, money that I can live off of, so it's not like I'm over here, like, ooh, I'm making money living off this shit. Um, I really just main main part other other than COD Champs events for me are just going and, and pretty much just having fun. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, be sure to give it a like. Uh, let me know anything you guys want to see. Leave it down in the comments. Um, I'll probably go play Pubs with Cost today and, and get some trolling videos. So as always, it's your boy Sharp. 